Well, it kind of it started when um, you know we're a, just part of a youth ministry at our church, Hillsong Church in Sydney, Australia, and really um, we were just encouraged by our leaders and you know straight from the top, our senior pastors Brian and Bobby to just really do whatever it is that we're passionate about, um, you know, and do it unto the glory of God. And so for us, that was our creativity and our music. And so really, we just got about trying to write songs that our friends in our schools and community would kind of enjoy that explain, you know, our heart and passion and our relationship with God. And kind of that was the, that's what how it all started. And, you know, no one's more surprised than us that we were able to record those songs and those songs have had the ability to travel around the world and for whatever reason we've ended up here talking to you about a movie that we're in that comes out tonight. <laughs> yeah. uh, Very yes. much so, yes. Yeah, no one was more it's surprised than us. <laughs> we thought it was actually a joke at, at first and, yeah. um, and I seriously thought when we met the director and the DP and, and the producers that once they met us they'll be like, oh no, we're not going to make a film about these guys. But as it turns out, they they committed Persevered. and then to, here we are today. Uh, <laughs> there was many. Yeah. It was a delightful experience. <laughs> but um <laughs> but yeah, we it I, I guess just having the cameras follow and it took us a few days to kind of acclimatize to having cameras and microphones and, and everything and then trying to be yourself. Um uh, but once we kind of once we kind of got kind of over that, uh it, it was easier. Yeah, I think yeah. a lot, of that, and it's actually hilarious, and we talk about it all the time, even just being worship leaders and, you know, whether we've been at church or, you know, travelling around the world, standing on a stage in front of people, but really for us, our job is to get everyone's attention so we can put their attention onto God, and so yeah. we're very much aware of that, and um, it, it's, it's a surreal experience for sure, and something that I think we just live with this uncomfortable feeling because we know... You know, it's the tagline of the, like the film that it's not about us, it's about him, and that's the absolute truth. So, you know, um, we had the premiere a couple of nights ago and there was a red carpet and cameras and it was, you know, no one thought it was more kind of funny than us. <laughs> and so it's definitely this kind of struggle, but I think what helps us to keep on doing and walking through it is knowing that, you know, we kind of have a responsibility to try and get people's attention, but we know with the attention that we want to point them towards Jesus. I don't, yeah, I don't know if we'd say we're Christian celebrities. How good is the term <laughs> Christian celebrity, by the way? It's great. Hopefully we're still the same people, regardless of a film or not. Well, I think that people would know that Tay is just a country girl. Yeah. That's kind of the... That's true. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I love these guys. Uh, we just hope that people are walking away with their heads lifted a little bit higher than when they first walked in and we would just hope that um, they would be inspired with whatever's in their hands mm. to do and that they would be encouraged and um, yeah, hopefully, maybe if they've never even, um, I don't know, encountered Jesus, maybe they would see it through this film and especially they would see that um, if God could do something in our very ordinary, normal lives then He can definitely do something in their life. Extraordinary. Um.